Hi, my name's Alice Wright and I was part of the 2015 cross country team that won NCA cross country. Um, wow, what a special day that was and truly memories that I will cherish forever. Um, that year, I don't know what was so special about it, but we just had such a great bond as a team and you know, I, I'm not sure whether it was just the coaches did a good job of sheltering us from that external pressure or whether, you know, it was the team itself that we just kept things lighthearted. Um, I remember we kind of had a joke about an avocado dance and we had this mantra that was um, expect nothing, achieve everything, which I, I think really rang true to what happened on that day um, back in 2015. You know, I, I think we, we knew that we had a great shot to win going in, but um, I don't think we quite realised, or put, well, I didn't personally, realise how, how many few points we really could score. Just that kind of shock that I had at the end of the race when I turned around and I saw the sea of turquoise. Um, you know, Courtney was fourth and I was fifth and Rona and Callie were 14th and 15th, I think, and Molly was in the low 20s and collectively we scored, I think it was 24 points. Um, it was definitely in the low 20s and yeah, just for us five to all be in the top 25 was just incredible and I certainly wasn't expecting expecting that but the stars really did align for us that day which was another kind of saying that we had going throughout that season um i just remember um on the day of the race about 10 minutes before i think everything got a little crazy and out of hand and the coaches did a great job of putting on a brave face but i remember courtney was throwing up from nerves and my shoelaces broke and Callie didn't have the right spikes in and i think just it was also overwhelming and I think getting to the start line um, we were just relieved to be there and I, I didn't personally I didn't have time for the nerves I didn't think to really catch up with me um, but I do remember getting a terrible start um, at Louisville there's a lot of tight corners in the initial uh, mile and you, you don't want to be at the back which I was so I really had to kind of aggressively wade my way through um, and I um, just kind of did what the coaches said find the turquoise um, I tried not to panic and just really sell out in that last mile and it paid off, um, paid off for all of us and we all had great races that day um, and honestly it's just so fun to look back on those memories and yeah as I said memories that I'll cherish forever and friendships that I think will last forever as well.